Which test from the list below doesn't require fasting? A. Iron test, TIBC. B. Lipid profile. C. Complete blood count, CBC. D. Renal function panel, CRF. Where can you quickly and accurately find the information you need about a dangerous chemical if you come across one? A. Procedural manual. B. Employee manual. C. Material safety data sheet, MSDS. What steps should you take to put on PP properly? A. Mask, gown, gloves. B. Gown, mask, gloves. C. Gloves, gown, mask. D. Mask, gloves, gown. The forearm vein most commonly used for venipuncture is the a. Median cubital. B. Basilic. C. Cephalic. D. Radial. The smallest veins in the human body are known as A. Villi. B. Bronchioles. C. Venules. D. Lymph glands. The aorta branches into smaller divisions called arteries, which in turn branch into even smaller divisions called A. Capillaries. B. Arterioles. C. Venules. Characteristics of capillaries include A. All of the above B. Having thin walls C. Forming microscopic pathways D. Connecting arterioles with venules Within the capillaries, blood cell functions include A. Releasing oxygen B. Binding carbon dioxide. C. Eliminating waste. D. All of the above. The heart, lymphatic organs, and blood vessels are in the system. A. Respiratory. B. Cardiovascular. C. Digestive. D. Urinary. The suffix uriat at the end of a medical term refers to what body location? A. Bloodstream. B. Urine. C. Kidney. D. Synovial fluid. The study of blood is known as A. Hematology B. Hematoxylin C. Hemoglobin D. Hemolysis The liver, stomach, mouth, and pancreas are in the system. A. Reproductive B. Sensory. C. Digestive. D. Muscular. The most important step to ensure accuracy in sample collection is A. Recording the time accurately. B. By always wearing gloves. C. Keeping the patient supine. D. Identifying the patient properly.
A microsample is generally collected from a nine-month-old infant by A. Finger stick B. Scalp stick C. Heel stick D. Venipuncture For which of the following tests must blood be drawn from an artery? A. Antihemophilic factor B. Chromosome analysis C. Hemoglobin A1c D. Blood gases When performing venipuncture on a patient with small, fragile veins, the best solution is to use A. A. Winged infusion set with syringe. B. Winged infusion set with evacuated tube. C. Smaller sized needle with evacuated tube. D. Standard sized needle with evacuated tube. Which of the following is not a cause of hemolysis? A. Failing to air dry antiseptic. B. Using a larger than needed needle. C. Using a smaller than needed needle. D. Shaking tubes vigorously. When collecting a sample of whole blood for testing using a lavender capped microtainer, how many inversions are needed to mix the blood with the additive? A. 6. B. 8. C. 10. Which of the following factors is likely to have the greatest effect on the results of a CBC processed within two hours of collection of the sample? A. Meal time. B. Mild exercise. C. Dehydration. If the laboratory protocol calls for the use of chlorhexidine solution for skin antisepsis for skin puncture or venipuncture, the antiseptic should not be used on infants younger than A. 12 months B. 6 months C. 2 months The maximum length of time a tourniquet should be left in place is a. 1 minute. B. 2 minutes. C. 3 minutes. D. 4 minutes. If unable to locate an adequate venipuncture site with a tourniquet applied, how long should the tourniquet be released before reapplying? A. 30 seconds. B. 1 minute. C. 2 minutes. When drawing blood from a patient in isolation for infection with Clostridium difficile, gloves should be donned. A. After palpating the site. B. Before entering the room. C. Immediately before preparing the site. Which government agency is responsible for laws governing the use of gloves when carrying out a venipuncture? A. USDA B. FDA C. CDC D. OSHA If a blood specimen is to be obtained for the trough level of a drug, the best time to draw the blood is usually a. 15 minutes before the next scheduled dose. B. 30 minutes before the next scheduled dose. C. 60 minutes before the next scheduled dose. The closure cap of the collection tube that contains sodium citrate is A. Gray B. Lavender 
C. Green. D. Light blue. If venipuncture is attempted and no blood returns when the evacuated tube is attached but the needle appears to be in the vein, the initial response should be to A. Consider an ankle vein. B. Remove the needle. C. Reposition the needle. If a patient had a right mastectomy six months ago, blood may be drawn from the a. Left arm. B. Left or right ankle. C. Right arm distal area only. D. Left or right arm. When performing venipuncture on a patient with extensive burns, the phlebotomist should A. Pad the tourniquet area. B. Avoid burned areas. C. Use a winged infusion set. D. Avoid using a tourniquet. If a patient is very angry and yells that the lab tests are a waste of time, which of the following is the best first response? A. Stay calm and listen. B. Explain the purpose. C. Leave the room. If an indwelling line, such as a central venous catheter, is used to obtain a blood sample, how much blood should be discarded before the sample is collected? A. 1 ml. B. 2 ml. C. 5 ml. The first step in carrying out a venipuncture is to A. Explain the purpose. B. Ask permission. C. Identify the patient. D. Identify the site. If, when performing a venipuncture in the antecubital space, the patient grabs the arm and complains of severe, shock-like pain, the initial response should be to A. Complete the blood collection. B. Remove the needle and apply pressure. C. Reassure the patient. If a patient in the emergency department refuses to have blood drawn but the phlebotomist does so at the physician's assistance, the phlebotomist may be charged with A. Assault B. Negligence C. Malpractice If, after leaving a patient's room, the phlebotomist is asked by the patient's brother what tests the patient is having, the phlebotomist should A. Provide the information B. Provide no information C. Deny having any knowledge If a very small hematoma is evident during the venipuncture, the best initial response is to A. Remove the needle, elevate the arm, and apply pressure. B. Remove the needle and apply an ice compress. C. Remove the needle and apply pressure. D. Observe and complete the venipuncture. After cleansing the skin for a venipuncture, the phlebotomist should not A. Allow the antiseptic to air dry B. Cleanse a second time C. Wipe the skin dry D. Choose an alternate site If blood must be drawn from an arm that has an four in place, the four should first be clamped for at least a. 1 minute. B. 2 minutes. C. 4 minutes.
D. 6 minutes. Which of the following should not be disposed of in a sharps container? A. Bloodstained gauze. B. Tube holder. C. Lancet. D. Opened clean needle. Which veins should not be used for venipuncture? A. Veins on the dorsal side of the hand. B. Veins on the palmar side of the wrist. C. Veins on the dorsal side of the wrist. D. Veins in the forearm. The primary difference between plasma and serum is that only plasma contains a. Enzymes b. Nitrogenous waste c. Fibrinogen d. Globulins For which of the following tests must the blood specimen be maintained at body temperature until processing? a. Cold agglutinins b. Lactic acid C. pH. D. Parathyroid hormone. The closure cap of the collection tube that has been specifically designed to meet AAMM requirements is A. Lavender. B. Yellow. C. Pink. For which of the following tests must the blood specimen be immediately chilled? A. Hematocrit B. Cryofibrinogen C. Cold agglutinins D. Lactic acid One of the reasons that serum is more often used for testing than plasma is that serum contains a. More antigens. B. Fewer antigens. C. More anticoagulants. D. Fewer gases. The purpose of a blood transfer device is to prevent A. Specimen contamination. B. A needle stick. C. Tube breakage. D. Spillage. The minimal acceptable draw volume for a green cap collection tube is A. 25%. B. 50%. C. 75%. D. 100%. If a gray capped collection tube is overfilled, the result may be A. No effect. B. Low test result. C. High test result. D. Clotting of the specimen. Wearing artificial nails especially increases the risk of harboring A. Fungi. B. Viruses. C. Gram negative bacteria. D. Gram positive bacteria. When collecting blood specimens with collection tubes with lavender, green, and light blue closure tops, the correct order of the draw, first to last, is A. Green, light blue, and lavender. B. Light blue, green, and lavender. C. Lavender, green, and light blue. When asked to collect blood from a vascular access device, the phlebotomist should recognize that this procedure. 
A. Is outside his or her scope of practice. B. Requires supervision. C. Requires no additional training. The cap color for the collection tube used for tests of therapeutic drug levels is A. Gold B. Green C. Light blue D. Gray The nerve most often injured with venipuncture is the A. Radial B. Ulnar C. Musculocutaneous D. Median For forensic collection of a blood sample, the specimen container must be A. Placed and sealed inside a transfer bag B. Taped shut C. Personally observed during testing D. Placed in a clear plastic bag.